Hi, I'm John Rohan, Director of Recreation Parks here in the Villages. Been part of this amazing organization and family for about 28 years. And today's presentation is going to focus on the services, programs, facilities that our department provides to our residents in this community. So welcome to the Recreation and Parks presentation. So our department is a nationally accredited uh, Recreation and Parks agency. We are getting ready to enter our 15th year as a, an accredited Parks and Recreation Agency. One of the elite in the entire country, um, the accreditation standards by CAPRA set the best practices for us to deliver exceptional parks and recreation services to our residents. And of course, we do that through our core values of stewardship, hospitality, hard work, creativity, and innovation, along with our purpose, mission, and vision statement, which is to provide first-class recreation and park services uh, to our residents and guests getting the most out of their lifestyle here in the villages. Our team is made up of approximately 600 employees, all dedicated to our core values, our mission, vision, and purpose, and following our best practices as an accredited parks and recreation agency. We have an administrative team with two assistant directors, Matt Armstrong and Casey Linton, as well as recreation manager, Pam Henry, and additional administrative support staff to assist our team and our residents um, at our offices located here um, at Lake Sumter Landing. Each of our recreation centers um, are staffed with degreed professionals or people with extensive background and experience in recreation and parks. And we have regional recreation centers, uh, village centers, all staffed with our professional team members and support staff who um, oversee the day-to-day -day operations of facility management and programming and services that are offered at those respective facilities. And at this point in time, our operating budget is approximately $23.5 million. Um, we have 74 full-time employees and approximately 480 part-time employees all coming to work every single day to deliver these exceptional parks and recreation services to our residents in the community. Since we are a master plan development and community, the villages, uh, the largest in the United States, our department is also one of the larger uh, agencies in the country. And as part of our design of our master plan community, we have geographically set up our community to have what we call our regional recreation centers. Those are our larger recreation centers, which are approximately 30,000 square feet. Underneath those regional recreation centers are our village recreation uh, centers. Um, they're approximately about 9,000 square feet. And then the neighborhood rec areas are traditionally your adult swimming pool with them. So collectively, each geographic area in the community has a host of recreational amenities and park services available for our residents to use who live conveniently close to those amenities and those recreation centers. But as an amenity paying resident, they have access and use to all the recreation services and programs that are offered um, throughout this wonderful community that we call the villages. In addition to the numerous recreation centers, the regional, the village, and the neighborhood rec areas that we oversee, if we added up all the pickleball courts and swimming pools, uh, we manage over close to 1,500 different amenities that fall under the purview of the Recreation and Parks Department. And these include the dog parks, um, the fitness clubs, the recreation park areas, the recreation centers, the Lake Sumter Line boats. Uh, so there is a tremendous amount of amenities for our residents to have access and use to enjoy in addition to the recreation center. So we hope everyone takes advantage of those services and gets the most out of their lifestyle. That is important and personable to you to improve your overall quality of life. So the recreation centers um, are open for business essentially seven days a week. All the recreation centers are operated uh, Monday through Sunday. They're open from 7 a.m to about 9 p.m. right now, usually till 10 o'clock. Our swimming pools are open from 7 to 7.30 to dusk, um, as well as our outside parks and amenity areas um, as well. So with the exception of our holidays, you can enjoy recreation services pretty much 365 days a year uh, right here uh, in the villages. We also have uh, three types of swimming pools in addition to the various recreation centers that we've designed. We have the sports pool, which are traditionally uh, located with the regional recreation centers. Uh, the sports pool is a water exercise program facility for residents only. And that pool consists of programs such as water aerobics, water volleyball, lap swimming, water walking. We offer scuba lessons and snorkeling and a variety of water exercise related programs. They're traditionally scheduled on the hour. Um, please bring your resident ID card and staff will be glad to assist you. 
The next type of swimming pool we have is our neighborhood adult pool. Um, these are traditionally associated with the neighborhood rec areas, and they're for residents and guests 30 years of age and older. And these are your passive type swimming pools where you can come sit in a lounge chair, read a book, listen to some of your favorite music with your headset on, and uh, just kind of relax. You can socialize and mingle with your neighbors and friends, do a little water walking if you would like to. But if you'd like to do any exercise program classes, we encourage people to use our sports pools, which are scheduled and organized by staff and our resident lifestyle volunteer leaders who oversee those programs and facilities. The other pool that we have is our family pools. These pools are traditionally with our village rec areas, and they are designed for residents and guests to use, um, for residents to bring their guests under 30 years of age to the swimming pool. Um, all residents and guests are required to have a valid resident ID card or guest ID card uh, when using the facilities. We encourage you to visit our website, of course, at districtgov.org or read our publication, The Villages Recreation and Parks Pub, with all the information about expectations, rules, uh, and how to make your experience the best when you're coming to use those facilities. Of course, you can call any of our staff at any of the facilities and they'll be glad to assist you as well with any questions you may have about use of amenities, age requirements, and how to get the most out of that experience uh, when using those respective amenities. So in addition to the wonderful recreation centers that we have, uh, we are also the Villages Recreation and Parks Department. So we have numerous passive park sites located throughout the villages. Uh, many of them have picnic tables, picnic pavilions, they have paved walking pathways, uh, some have outdoor exercise, fitness equipment that they can use. This is their great park element for you to come do passive recreation if you like. You wanna read a book, you wanna do a little bit of artwork out there, we encourage you to do that. These are all conveniently located throughout our community as well. And we continue to expand our park offerings uh, due to the abundance of the natural environment that our community sits in, where the natural elements are very complementary to our master plan community and the infrastructure that we have here. So there's a great harmonious uh, opportunity to experience our park settings in line with our infrastructure of our recreation centers for our residents' uh, enjoyment. We have currently 3,000 resident lifestyle volunteer clubs. Our resident lifestyle volunteers are an integral part of our operations and services that we provide to our residents in the community. Our residents lead a variety of exercise programs, uh, art programs, passive programs, active programs, everything that you see pretty much scheduled inside our rec centers and outside. Um, our resident lifestyle volunteer leaders are intimately involved in helping our other residents get involved with that respective program or activity to learn how to participate in it, uh, the equipment and supplies needed for enjoying that activity. And so those 3,000 resident lifestyle volunteers are, are partner with us in recreation and parks in enhancing and enriching those lifestyle services that our residents will experience when they're utilizing our recreation centers and our park elements as well. So uh, if you'd like to be a resident lifestyle volunteer, check with any of the staff at any of the centers. It's a very simple process. We'd love to have you join our team and share your skill or knowledge of a particular activity. Um, many of our volunteers have been doing it anywhere from one year up to 20 years providing a particular service uh, that they lead and instruct uh, to our residents in the community. We're very blessed and very fortunate with the tremendous amount of talent that we have in our community where our residents will provide their, their background and their skill uh, set to enhance the lives of our residents to get the most out of their recreation experience. In addition to the daily resident lifestyle activities and programs that take place in our recreation centers and around the community, uh, we also have a host of lifestyle events that we schedule throughout the year. These are events like Camp Villages. Camp Villages is an intergenerational camp program for our visiting grandchildren and our residents to, to sponsor together and participate in a variety of arts and crafts programs, exercise related programs, astronomy type programs. These programs are run throughout the course of the year. We do stuff during the holiday season, during Easter, during Christmas. And of course, during summer is a very, very popular time of year for camp villages where our residents can enjoy quality structured time with their visiting grandchildren in a numerous amount of lifestyle activities that are offered as part of the Camp Villages program. We also do 5K road races. Uh, we offer the senior games throughout the year. We have softball tournaments, pickleball tournaments, 
uh, leagues that are offered. Uh, we have lessons uh, for all our activities that we offer. So if you're new to the villages and never played pickleball before or never heard of platform tennis before, uh, between our staff and dedicated resident lifestyle volunteer leaders, we can provide the lessons and the instruction as well as the, the equipment to get you out there acclimated to the lifestyle program or service that you are going to be making as part of your life living here uh, in the villages. So there are ongoing scheduled socials and events throughout the year. Um, and we're very excited about that because we always are expanding those opportunities for our residents in addition to their daily uh, lifestyle program and activities that they offer, we offer these special events, lifestyle events, uh, to enhance the experience at our recreation centers and our facilities for your use. We recently just created another division for the Villages Recreation and Parks Department. We have what we call the Enrichment Academy. We affectionately call it T, T-E-A. It stands for the Enrichment Academy. The Enrichment Academy is an instructional Based, fee-based program where residents can sign up for instruction, instructor-led classes and programs, everything from the arts and crafts to, to learning a language, to learning about travel, uh, different topics on history. Uh, we have a speaker series that comes in with world-renowned speakers who talk on a specific subject matter. And so the Enrichment Academy um, are structured classes where people can register and they run anywhere from four weeks to eight weeks on that particular uh, program or activity for residents to sign up for. If you're interested in becoming an instructor, we are expanding that program as well. And we are always looking for talented people to join our Enrichment Academy team to help foster another level of lifestyle opportunities for our residents to get out there and take a class in a particular subject matter. The good thing is there's no grades at the Enrichment Academy. You come, you learn, you enjoy, you socialize, and you have a wonderful experience. So Enrichment Academy continues to grow and blossom for us. We're very excited about the, the endless potential the Enrichment Academy holds for our residents in the community and look for great things to continue to happen with T. So now that we've talked about lifestyle programs and services and our resident lifestyle volunteer leaders and the wonderful endless amenities and recreation centers and parks that we have here. We also have a very dedicated customer service program where our regional centers serve as our customer service locations for you to get guest ID cards to sign up for trail fees to receive assistance in trying to start a resident lifestyle club. We've added an additional layer to those uh, regional centers. There's three of them that provide enhanced services. So if you wanna rent a room or you'd like to learn more about starting a club, um, we call these recreation center hubs, which provide ad additional services for you for resident lifestyle club formation, for room reservations, and those locations are La Hacienda Regional Recreation Complex, Seabreeze Regional Recreation Complex, and then the Fenny Regional Recreation Complex, and we continue to expand that. This program allows our residents the convenience, instead of going to one location, there's three convenient locations to receive these additional enhanced services, and in addition to the already services that are available at your nearest regional recreation complex as well. So make sure you take advantage of that information that's available to you so we can better serve our residents in a convenient manner that's in geographically closer to you to have access to those services provided by our team and our department. So where do we find all this wonderful information that I've been talking about in this presentation? The Villages Recreation and Parks publication, which comes out every Thursday, it is inserted in the Villages Daily Sun. It is also available at all of our regional and village rec centers for you to pick up. And it is a publication that lists the schedule of activities and events. It also has very useful information and websites that you can go to to obtain additional information. We also have districtgov.org, which if you go to districtgov.org, you click on the recreation link there and you will have all the information you need about how you can become engaged with recreation and parks in your hometown. We have VNN, which is Villages News Network, which comes out on some of the cable stations here. Uh, the Villages app, please download the Villages app that has the community calendar. It has useful information about events and programs that are taking place. Um, and then also we post some uh, general information on our recreation center bulletin boards. And our latest addition to our communication platform is 
our digital billboards. Our digital billboards are high definition TV screens that we have installed at all the regional recreation centers that has a calendar of events that are taking place. So it is constantly being updated and scrolling uh, great information about whether it's uh, events taking place or property management improvements that are taking place or some temporary closures to get the facilities cleaned and looking beautiful for their ongoing use uh, and enjoyment. So there's a great communication platform out there for residents to find out what's going on and how to stay connected with all the upcoming current events and things to come in recreation and parks that are provided uh, year round every single day right here at, in the villages. So we hope you enjoyed this presentation. There's so much more we could talk about related to recreation and parks, but we wanted to give you a snippet of information to get you excited how you can get involved. Please know that our 600 uh, employees are committed and dedicated to serve you. We are in the business of customer service and public service uh, in serving our residents and guests to have the best experience when they interact and engage with our department and our staff and our facilities. And we hope you get the most out of your life. And thank you for, for watching.